Hello, and welcome to the Vintage Aquasium, the program where I show you all the vintage things that I found to sell for a profit. Profit for me, goodies for you. Cheers! Before we start, let's talk about mug of the day, or maybe a cup of the day. Very posh, with saucer. Carlton Pottery. It's like 70s to the 90s. Inside there's coffee, we need energy because today we're going to discuss 11 fantastic vintage objects. And let's start strong with vase, glass decent sized swung vase in a very vibrant neon colors. Very optimistic, very summery. The colors are bright, the shape is good, the size is decent. Los perfectos. Like we said, this vase has very summery colors. Summer, parties, friends, games. If you want to entertain your friends, why not to do it with old school domino game? This is a full set of dominoes with a dice. You can display it like this, or be more creative and make a little swirl. Pieces are in very good condition, wooden. The stand itself looks like one big piece of domino. And if you look closely, it has very faded Mallorca sign. Very creative sculptural gaming piece. And now something for your kitchen, or not. You can put it anywhere, bathroom maybe, hallway, also living room. Depends on your decor. This is vintage, made in Belgium, apothecary jar. It's a milk glass covered in black and white beautiful 70s flowers. The stopper is in very good condition and without it you can use it as a vase. On the bottom it's stamped Belgium and if the flowers would be in brown color or maybe orange I would keep it myself. But black is for more stylish, maybe minimalist people. Imagine this in a very minimalist kitchen and suddenly BOOM! Patterns. We have a lot of patterns today and one of them is this. Very abstract, probably owl. If you look this way, this drawing looks like an owl. Two hypnotized eyes and a beak with a huge wart. It looks a little bit like pool pottery, but it's not marked. And it does have a little cute feet. Use it for your snacks, use it for your rings, use it for your fake teeth. Whatever you need to be used for, here it is for you in the Vintage Equation Shop. Another fantastic animal that the Vintage Equation can provide you with today, it's the boar. The wild boar. The boar of wilderness. Sculptural boar. Designer boar. Candlestick holder boar. Claudio Puli Boar. In a very good condition with few chips on his lips. Maybe it also have some warts, just like the owl. It's missing a bum. It doesn't have a bum. Very flat. So maybe you can put it like this and it will be howling. Howling Boar. Oh, maybe they did it like this so you can see the name of the artist. Very clever. So now when all your friends will come, they will see exactly that it's Claudio Puli. Did he really want his signature to be visible? Is it coincidence? Was he lacking of clay to finish the piece? Why it's flat? We'll never know, but we know that it's beautiful, unique, one of the kind, and it's available in our shop. In our shop also you can find another vase. Today we have three vases, and this one is made in East Germany. East and West Germany were providing us in the 60s and 70s with amazing cool designs of vases. This one has fat lava glazing, rough volcanic looking leafy pattern. It is stamped, it is marked, it is numbered. Fat lava glaze looks a little bit like pumice stone for your feet. So if you're really struggling in the summer with hard heels, you can use this vase. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Very nice piece and would look great with roses. And if you don't have any roses, we can provide you some. Perfect! This set of 770s roses is available in our shop. They are very interesting. The plastic feels like fiberglass. This green bit is definitely normal plastic, but the other things are fiberglassy type of plastic. They have different lengths, so you don't have to worry that one rose would overtake another. And they do in fact look good in the vase. Here, perfect! Here we have something small, but different. If you look at it, it looks like a clamshell. And it is, but it's fake. It's carved in stone. This is all made of stone, almost like this stone eggs, but it's not an egg. Here I'm drinking coffee, enjoying myself. But what if I would like to drink water, juice? Fizzy drink. This cup wouldn't be enough, would be too small, would be too posh, plus also liquidy liquids. It's good to see in the glass. And here we have six tall, elegant glasses in gay design. Just so you know, I'm not lying to you. Ravenhead glass slim jeans. They are not here. 
because they're standing here, beautifully washed for you. I have a full set of these high balls. They've never seen a dishwasher before, so they are in perfect condition. No tips, no cracks, very vintage, very summery. The box is original, but as you can see, it is a bit damaged. But if you put glasses inside, the box looks great. You can even display it or just use it. Why not use it? Don't display. Use your vintage. Don't hesitate. Buy it and enjoy your gay designs. Denby, the 60s, and more gay designs like this. Arabesque. Arabesque is one of the prettiest Denby designs. And we have here a set of salt and pepper shaker and a little jam pot. They are in perfect condition with stoppers. The jam pot has a little spoon and the best part the spoon is from British Airways. It fits perfectly here. It even has a nice smoky color. It looks like a set. This set I bought together with sugar bowl. Sugar bowl unfortunately was cracked and damaged and I kept it as a planter. For you, I have only undamaged pieces in perfect condition. And the last piece I brought home yesterday. It was marked as Murano glass, but after a research, I know it's not. This Tanning vase is in fact Czechoslovakian glass and it's a designer piece by Josef Hospotka. It is heavy, it is in perfect condition, has nicely polished bottom and incredible ombre color color period. The quality is amazing. I'm not surprised that someone was claiming it's Murano glass. It's soft, it's smooth, it's polished and the inside looks fantastic. If you can display it like this, it looks stunning with the sun coming through it and probably will look good with these roses. Maybe not. It has no damage at all, just beautifulness, qualityness, uniqueness, ombriness, yellow orangeness, hand blownness, smoothness, might be yourness. It will be perfect also for Halloween and autumn displays. And that's it. I'm very happy with the haul today. I think I brought you good pieces and all these good pieces can be yours. I will leave the link down below to my shop so you can check it and buy it, of course. Please do. Subscribe to my channel, leave the thumbs up and let's gather very soon in the next video. I'll bring you more amazing stuff. I already brought some incredible pieces and everything is there in front of me in the huge mess. The mess of beautifulness. Beautiful things only in Vintage Aquasium shop. Now I can only say goodbye and cheerio!